they rolled out the yellow carpet for Geraint Thomas in Cardiff, and the Tour de France hero reigned on his own parade. As thousands turned out to welcome home cycling's Prince of Wales after his stunning triumph last month, Thomas revealed he would be signing a new contract at Team Sky. Listen carefully, and you could almost hear the groans across the channel. No sooner have they found a way to stop Chris Froome winning their showpiece bike race than along comes another British rider to rule the peloton, and he isn't going anywhere. Thomas will sign a new three-year deal with Sky, worth up to and pound, four million a year, after being courted by rival teams since he won the yellow jersey in Paris 12 days ago. He said, I've made my mind up, about staying, in my head really and just need to get it done officially. It's nice to have some good offers, but hopefully it will be done in the coming days. New Polish team CCC World Tour, a merger of CCC Sprandy and BMC Racing, had launched a bid to sign Thomas from Team Sky, whose contract expires at the end of this year. But Thomas, cheered by vast crowds who painted the town yellow from the Senate, the Welsh National Assembly, to Cardiff Castle has decided familiarity breeds contentment. He revealed, there's obviously a lot of good teams out there, I respect them and I wanted to hear what they had to say. But I'm happy in the team I'm at and it works for me. I feel a real part of it. I grew up in the system and I've known them all since I was 17. Thomas was a 14-1 outsider before the 2,082-mile long haul from the Vendee to the Champ Sailies A. Eh? But four times champion Froome deferred leadership of the Team Sky train to Thomas and settled for third place as a super domestique. The double Olympic track gold medalist believes their twin-pronged approach could work again, adding, I think the way we went about it this year was the right way to go. If the roles were reversed next year, I would be disappointed like Froomey because you want to win, but at the same time, if Froomey is the stronger rider, you do your bit in support. Thomas was blown away by the sheer scale of the parade, which echoed the carnival's greeting to fellow ex-pupils of Whitchurch High School, Sam Warburton and Wales Six Nations Rugby Grand Slam champions in 2012, and Gareth Bale and the Welsh football squad after reaching the Euro 2016 semi-finals. He joked, I was worried it might just be my wife and the dog, but the support has been insane. Thomas's father, Hywell, said, I don't think the rugby players can touch his performance. They will have to beat the All Blacks to top Geraint winning the Tour de France.